It's more about actually looking at uh, iLock Cloud and how to license and activate your Pro Tools subscriptions or any other um, iLock licenses you have if you haven't got a license for or uh, iLock a physical license. So I've currently got open my iLock license manager. And as you can see, these are the ones I've got available. And the on the section on the left, these are the ones that are actually connected. Anything that's grayed out might be other computers. I've got a guest cloud account, which is for something different, which I might talk about at a later point. But basically, it's really, really simple to set up a cloud account for moving your licenses. It means I don't have to physically move a iLock license from home. Um, take it back or if I forget something it's actually much much easier doing this so I don't have to if I if something breaks with Avid now it means I don't actually have to buy a new iLock license I can just um, activate the account online all I need to do is go to file and go open your cloud session and it'll come up with saying like operation in progress and it comes up with like a little studio cloud and straight away We've got my Pro Tools Ultimate, I got Heat, the Avid Bundle, and any other license that's available in my main account will come up here. So then that will mean that now I can open up Pro Tools Ultimate. This will then come up on the Pro Tools window. So we've got Pro Tools, and you see it says Pro Tools Ultimate. And just to prove something in a second, I'll just restart. Um, I'll just quit Pro Tools again. Uh, let's quit Pro Tools, and I'm going to open up the iLock License Manager again. So we come back open, and then if I click the, if I click on this, I go close my cloud session. This will automatically put all my licenses, de deactivate everything, and it will put it just ready to kind of go. If I open up Pro Tools now, you'll note it should notice this time it won't say Ultimate; it will go to something else. It'll just say just say Pro Tools, and it'll be like Pro Tools Standard, just normal Pro Tools. So I got I got two versions of Pro Tools, and Pro Tools Ultimate is in my cloud. It just means I don't have to worry about. Um, yeah, it means I don't have to worry about actually transferring licenses and worrying about physical licenses. It's really, really useful. I absolutely love it. Really hope that you have a look into that as well. And one final time, open your cloud session and they automatically just get deposited in. Don't have to manually activate everything and they all come up like this. And then if I want to log in on my laptop at home, I just log in there, open the cloud session there and it will automatically ask me to close the session um, from that point. So I love it. Um, you do need to make sure your computer is um, connected, but it's a really, really cool little tip and one to try out for the future.